Using a formula wheel. Step one, like anything, is what's the question? Step two is what do you know? Step three is select a formula. And step four is like a done deal. So the first, the hardest thing I find people have on word problems, they don't even know what the question is. They're stunned. Don't get stunned. Find out what am I asking for? What's the voltage? What's the resistance, the power, you know, the current? Then what do I know? Circle those. And then... Go to the wheel. So here is something asking, what's a current if you know the KW and if you know the voltage? Okay, if you know the KW and you know the voltage, what's a current? Well, I is equal to P over E. Not even going to waste any time. And it happens to be formula number four in the wheel. Okay, well, what about if you ran two wires and it carries 16 amps and it's 75 feet of 12 gauge wire? And that wire has a resistance of 0.15 ohms each, just so we're not having you to go to chapter 9, table 8 or table 9. Okay, well, I'm looking for the power. Power, well, that's going to be number 10, I squared R, because I know the I and I know the R. Now, this is going to be, I think, 0.15 ohms for this wire, 0.15 ohms for this wire. You add them together, it's going to be 0.3. So if you know the resistance of the wires and you know the current in this series circuit will remain the same, be 16, I squared R. So know the question, find the formula, do the math. So we don't need to. Um, let's go to another graphic here. Let me go to the question. What's the resistance? Um, oh, what is resistance? Oh, what's the resistance? of the wire if I know the voltage drop and if I know the current flowing in there. So if we're looking for the resistance, resistance, that's E. I know I and I know I and E, the right, the voltage. Oh, oh this is it. Oh, this is the voltage drop of the wire right here from here to here. So I know I and E, and I'm looking for R. I and E. Well, so number two, that's going to be E over I. Three volts over 100 is 0.03 ohms for the, uh, the resistance of both wires. Now here, okay, resistance, okay, times two. Either way, you can get one or you can do both. What's the voltage of a circuit carrying 1.2 amps supplying 100 ohms? Okay, I'm looking for the voltage is E. I have I and R given. So E is the question. I and R is given. E is equal to I times R. I times R, 120 volts. I won't say it's boring, but it's boring here, right? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> oh,